guys, here we are in Weldon Springs. So uh, he's going to replace the furnace and AC. You see he's got an Arzell system, so we're going to replace this box, but reuse the dampers. Um, on the Arzell system, he is missing one damper right here in this basement, so we need a, a six inch Arzell damper um, added right here. The uh, Freon lines, so the other thing we're going to do, we're going to turn this furnace 180 degrees so that it's facing this way. Um, he's going to move these shelves over a little bit so that we got some a little bit more room for our return drop. Um, we're going to put this new uh, panel back in the same place and go with uh, Honeywell IQ stats, or Vision Pro stats probably is what we got to do. The, uh, um, let's see, so also while we're over here, this duct is rusted all the way through, so we're going to have to replace this transition right here. Uh, also, um, we need to replace, let's see what else, um, I think that's it for this side. Oh, we're going to go with uh, 90 plus furnace, uh, so we are going to vent out this side, and that's right where the air conditioner is outside. You can see the Freon lines running down here. So on this side of the furnace, so now, this is currently the front, but it's going to be the back of the furnace when we're done. and. Um, We'll just need a cap for his uh, food pipe. Um, the Freon lines will be turned around the other way so we can uh, do that. The drain is real simple right here. The gas piping looks good there. Um, but we also want to add a basement return. So if you could bring in the 8 inch, uh, eight inch elbow, 8 inch duct, 8 inch start collar, and a uh, uh, 6 by 14 register. We're just going to go through the wall and just put a register right over here on this side of the wall. You see we're right by the TV here. We'll put the register low on the wall. Down here. Uh, I think that's about it. All right. Thank you.